All right. Let's end this. Yeah. Welcome, Internet, to part five of Eeb. Oh, we've never gotten an applause before we began. Yeah. Well, I like now that. we're the queen of high society. What was the other painting with a stuff in it? I don't know. I don't think... I didn't actually notice it when I first went through. Look at this. Annulated oh, woman. Drown in the abyss. Just do it, though. Well, um, we already I think are. There was, there was a thing I was saying in the last video about the... Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah. So this is the grand puzzle of this. Is Literally, there is a puzzle. <laughs> um... It's able to float because of art. Haven't you ever read the Hitchhiker's Guide? <laughs> it looks beautiful. Armatures, probably. Trist after death. Like, the sprite work here is really nice. Yeah. Hey, it's a lady in red. And they're in the frames. Oh, yeah. I didn't even think about it. Is death Gary? Huh? Well, Gary's wearing a tattered coat, and Death's cape is tattered. Uh, don't think so. Okay, <laughs> sorry. But uh, yeah, so there's a part in the end where there was that ant talking about how it wanted to eat lots of stars. Uh, Planet killer, yeah. Yeah, and it, it remind it reminded me of um from the disaster artist um. There's a part where Greg Sestero is asking Tommy uh, is asking uh, Tommy Wiseau. Um, what his um, what his life's ambitions are? Go together with Gary. Yeah, let's never split up again. Mayhem of color. Uh, but one of the things was when he, because Greg was talking, Greg was talking about his own ambitions in life, uh -oh. like he wanted to become, he wanted to become an actor and stuff like that. And Tom, he he asked Tommy what his life dream was, and Tommy said, "I want to have my own planet." <laughs> oh no! I want to have my own planet. And people will come and visit me there. <laughs> Maybe he is an alien. Bye, cactus room. Yeah. We also crushed the mayhem of color painting. Just obliterated it. It wasn't very good anyway. Gotta put together a painting. Alright. Black canvas. I wanna paint. When this is done, maybe I'll make <laughs> a painting. <laughs> or maybe I'll take a nap. Either or. Either or, yeah. Collect works of Gortana. Eyes. Enlightenment. View of a side of a person's eye. Catch. middle page bashful glance so we've actually seen this painting before actually in this game yeah that was the one that crossed the gap yeah I didn't realize that uh, when I first did this we saw enlightenment too yeah yeah he's donated to the school he's attended its whereabouts have been unknown for years and there's no picture because the person who wrote the book couldn't find it cycloptic smile Cyclopean. Originally and, drawn with two eyes. Yes. Is this a reference to the Mona Lisa? Uh, I don't know that one. Although, yeah, probably. They because talk about she's it got a mysterious stole. smile, and uh, like they've they've gone through and like X-rayed it and saw all the like all the process that went into it before it became the finished piece. I mean, that's possible. They also talk about how it was famous for being stolen once. Which is, like, the plot of every heist movie ever. <laughs> We're stealing the Mona Lisa. That was oh, actually the... movie... The, hmm? Cubism. That's not something that Quartana did. I want a movie is... that's just, like... Kind of Carmen Sandiego-esque, where they decide to steal something ridiculous... What up uh, in the is when a work is, is completed, the something is lost. Hmm. I like how you wrote that over several pages. Yeah. 
Uh oh. What is happening? I don't know. Probably not anything good. Like a flood? What is that? We have a path that'll only be shown to those pure of heart. You go ahead, Ib. <laughs> um, I remember that was uh, one of my favorite uh, Doctor Who episodes, though. Um, the City of Death, I remember, actually involved stealing the Mona Lisa, but took it to its, uh, took it to its extreme. Um, where the basic plot of it is that uh, their encounter, they're dealing with an alien who um, he was in a ship that uh, was damaged, oh. and they could only take off. They could only take off using the warp drive, which caused the ship to explode and caused his it caused his consciousness to be scattered over uh, like multiple different periods in history. Oh God! <laughs> Void red, chase black. Okay. And so the thing is that he's trying. He's he's the aliens trying to construct a time machine so he can go back and tell himself not to uh, tell himself. Yeah. <laughs> But so he can construct a time machine so he can tell himself not to go back and do the thing that caused his consciousness to get scattered. Um, but they also discover that it's because his ship exploded that humanity exists. Oh. Um, because there was the primor they they go back to the time that the ship crashed, which was uh the pri like the primeval era. And whoops, I accidentally escaped because I was trying to catch all the little You gotta guys. get all the people. Um, Push yourself. But like one of the things that I like is that uh, their their main plan is that to to fund to finish funding the time machine, they're going to steal and sell the Mona Lisa. Um, but the thing that they the thing that that nobody knows except for him is that he uh, is that he, there's a version of him that's talking to Leonardo da Vinci, telling him to paint more Mona Lisas, <laughs> and he has and so he has like eight copies of them in his basement. <laughs> and or, yeah, he has eight copies of them in, in his basement, and he's uh, and um, he's the only one that knows about. He, and so he set up uh, nine different auctions at the same time, knowing that whoever owns the Mona Lisa isn't going to display it because it's going to be apparent that they own this stolen painting. <laughs> That's genius. How many red figures are there? Oh, uh, there's only two. two. Just two. So we've okay, captured all the black around, figures though. at this point. Oh, 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 oh. So we gotta put all the guys back in their book. Get in there. Gotta put all the charcoal guys back in there. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and we cured the insomnia coffin. Aw. Gets to take a nap. Even oh. inanimate objects are just so much cuter when they're sleeping. Okay, alright. This is not good. What? Hey, what? the bird's following us. Peep, peep. It's so cute. So we have to. I think I went in too fast because the. Nope, there we go. Oh, you're a pure of heart, aren't you? Go! Go, little friend! So, you remember that pattern? Nope. No? Neither did I. Okay. Okay. It's like, oh, okay, I can't just follow the bird. I have to do the thing. So if we do this again, I think the bird comes back. Yeah, so that's where we get the hint. Apparently that right. bird was too pure, too good for this world. <laughs> Perfect little cinnamon bun. It's like, yep, I don't remember the pattern at all. <laughs> oh, no. So you gotta go out and go back in. And the bird shows it to you again. Pay a fucking attention this time. There's a lot of steps to it. 
There's like eight of them, and there's no like line or anything. I have to do a little dance. It's like no, I think I fucked that up. Ah. <laughs> Like, I'm actually, I was actually tracing on the monitor with my finger to follow the pattern here. What you do is you get a Sharpie marker and you draw on your screen. And then that's just great forever. <laughs> you like always my, know the answer. I gotta go, hold on, there's a lot of spelling errors here. I gotta go through with my light pen <laughs> cross some of these out. <laughs> nope, nope, all right, all right. But apparently I solved it. Oh, oh, super, okay, you did it. Oh. Place of warmth. Oh. And inside the painting was a piece of another bigger painting. It's so happy. We just keep writing wrongs in this whole, mu in this whole gallery. In this eternal gallery. Yeah, this artist had, like, a lot of, uh... Whoa... issues. He just poured like himself into everything there. he made. <laughs> I like how you hesitated, like, they're not gonna come crawling after me, are they? <laughs> I had to wait for it. Hmm. So one of the paintings is moving. All right. Top painting. There we go. Hi. Boop. Wow, I would not have caught that at all. Yeah, I was just basically playing spot the differences with, you know, nine million things. <laughs> it was like highlights for adults. <laughs> Oh, it is not. It is not looking good in here. Yeah, but we're down to three pieces left to get. Is it ink? I'm not sure. It looks like they're just kind of uh, comes off as a lack of effort to me. <laughs> Contemporary art. Should we rest for a bit? I love running around and wearing my legs. This is miserable. There's a bench, like, right there. I feel like my legs are becoming one with the ground. Aw. <laughs> hey, wake up. Hey, hey, hey. Um. Oh, no. Um. Uh, hello? Uh-oh. Oh, no. So you want to see, like, legit reactions to things, just like how many times I went back to Gary. Oh, no. Come on, man. You're not, like, for realsies, though. No, you have to tell us this word. Gotta tell you what the word in the bottom right of the painting means. Hey. Hey, man. You're... It's okay. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Shouldn't go out alone. You're not. You're. Come on. Come on. I. I. Book with a strange smell. Entering the secret room. Lower right, the lower wall. right wall. Boy, I'm glad. I thinking about it now. I'm glad that that's a uh, should you something. You'll never leave the room again. I'm also glad that boy position is uh, not relative. Back of the bookcase. Small writing on the back of the shelf. Now look along the gap next to the long bookshelf. Okay. Oh, I see it. Nope. Stop reading. Stop reading this book. 
You want to know more about the eyes, though? They're like windows to the soul. So I misread this at first and thought it said it said the gap in the long bookshelf. Now look at the canvas. Oh, hey, look at the... No, there's the canvas on the bottom right. Look, there's <laughs> words on it now. Oh, wake up, dude. Don't be dead. Writing on the canvas, close your eyes and count to three. Then it should be ready. Okay. Three. And Still? there's a pull cord. Uh? Something crows and five somethings. So now we Counting have to go... Counting crows and five for fighting. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> so here's the puzzle here is we have to look at this endlessly scrolling painting and figure out how many things of... How many things... How many crows there are and which thing there is five of. Oh... This is actually really hard because there's part there's a part of this painting where it looks like it loops, but it actually loops later. Yeah. Oh. Three crows and five somethings. One. Two. Three. Three. Four. Oh no, it's not stars. Is it five? Something? It's probably loops a lot because I picked, I, I had to pick a point where I decided it started and then yeah. I had to go through and just count one of each thing. The snake the it is where I've been starting. And also this is a puzzle, this is a puzzle where they didn't uh, change it to a, they didn't change it to a multiple selection. So when you want to enter the thing, you have to enter it in you have to enter the whole word with a text oh, okay. with a text thing. Hmm. Is it three crows and five snakes? No. Something that a crow can hold in its mouth. I believe it is five fish. Oh wow, I haven't even seen any fish. They're the blue things. Oh yeah, you have to figure out what the blue things are. Yeah. So, uh, adventures in looking at things. <laughs> We're looking so hard. You can't even stand it. Peen. Oh. Petals. Nope. All right. Did you just look up a walkthrough then? <laughs> no. I just went back and stared at this painting some more. <laughs> I never, I will say, I never the true went, museum I, I experience. Never, never went to a walkthrough for this. Now I'm down to the last guess, because if I fail again, then I'm dead. <laughs> you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. I believe in you. I also realized that making that it being fish um, works out really well in the English. It works out really well in the in English because uh, fish is the plural of fish. Fishes. Switch on the wall. Press it. Press do it. it. Do it. Do it. There we go. You you did it. <gasps> He's not dead. Yeah. No, Thank I was God. so relieved. Yeah, no, okay, I was super sure he was dead. Tile yeah, in the lower right corner too. of the painting. Peep. Peep. You didn't know that word? Apparently not. Oh. Is it space? Is it the infinite blackness of space? Or it's the void. And only a little bit left. Now we gotta go... 
get the last couple pieces. Do it. We're also heading we to this. probably one of the other puzzles that I did not get immediately because you have about half a second to look at the thing. I also didn't look at this. Uh, I think I, yeah, I didn't look at the title for this. Oh, no, I did. Birth of the Copernicus Revolution. <laughs> what a bad place to be. Uh oh. Is this a Gortana piece? It's just beyond the realm of sense. Yep. So, Birth of the Copernican Revolution. So, right now, right now, you have a chance to look at this thing. Uh, uh five? I count one, two, three, four, five, maybe? Okay, that's. You, you counted things, that's not what you're supposed to do. Damn it! Alright. There's a red thing. It was a red thing. Oh. Also, I think it's. I think this is a. I think this is a uh, thing because this game was translated from Japanese. Eve never says "What about you?" She always says. She always refers to Gary as Gary, which is a thing. Um. So you have to figure out which of the things, which of the things we passed, did not belong, and you have to pick two of them. Oh no. So I didn't know this, so I was just going off of things that did not look like they belonged in our solar system. <laughs> also, this took me two tries, I'll just say that right out. Um, <laughs> um but one of the things that's but the thing that Eve constantly refers to Gary just by his name because that's a thing that uh children do in Japanese. Oh. Gortana. Right. Whoa. I mean, it's really not a self-portrait. Just crawling up in there. We're going to meet the man. So here's one of the other things. Um, if um, if Gary dies, this is another place where we can actually... Um, this is another place where the game can end. Hmm. I don't know why I keep checking all the different parts of the velvet rope here. Is one special? No, I'm supposed to push the table out of the way. <laughs> I think it's because we haven't had a lot of table pushing segments. Is it a bed? Yeah. Nostalgia. So if oh, you say blue, blue so, rose petals there. Yeah, so if you say sleep on if you say sleep on the bed. Mm-hmm. Um, Gary will say, don't do that. But if Gary's dead, if you go and sleep on the bed, that's where the game ends. Oh, okay. And now we have the black key, which gives us, um, which gives us some extra post-game stuff. So now we're back in the gallery. We we're are, the, except all the walls are different. Embodiment of spirit. So I go through here and also read all these things because Gary can still read all the titles. Yeah. Can only bloom in wholesome bodies. Abyss of the Deep, which is a title we never got before. Yeah. Because Eve did not know what a, the word abyss. A well-meaning hell, which now mm -hmm. you can see the mother, like, scolding the child. Beach isolation. Beach isolation. Horizon view. Class of Antipodes. Serpent Spirit. And this is the one where we couldn't get, like, any part of the title. Twinkling of Crystals and Stars. Oh! Sky Seen from a Hill. There's the coughing man again. You notice also that Abyss of the Deep is, like, the title, is the main picture for the Guernica Gallery. Or Gwer sure. Gwertana. Yeah. Lady taking the newspaper. Yeah. It's it's like really impressive. I can see how they would make it yeah. the centerpiece. Even in pixel art. Especially in pixel art. The lady in red. Pitcher fruit. Spectacle of Century's End. Wariness. This guy did a lot. 
Yeah, like I was saying, he's like he's like Giger levels of prolificity. Before those were um and ah, weren't they? Um, uh, (laughs) ah. Yeah, and so so when they come together, it's called fusion. Ah. The something. So remember, even on the other side, this was called some, this was called something world. Yeah. The fabricated world. We're meant to jump into a painting. So far, it's just been a matter of literally jumping into him. And then the frame disappeared. Those things are worthless anyway. Eve. Come on. Who do you trust? Oh. Well, my mother might not ever say, don't you ever want to see your mother and father again? So, yeah. (laughs) Also, I think it was supposed to be in line with um, the come. Mm, Oh, yeah, come, Yeah. 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 Hey, for realsies, for really reals, we're back. Back. People. Real people. Pretentious douchebags. <laughs> hmm. Yes, yeah, death of the individual, something, something. Hey, there's Eve's parents. Up at the top. Yeah. Well, then, where's Gary? Remember all that hell we just went through? Well, neither does Eeb. Well, later. Hmm? Bye. What's this handkerchief? Oh, yeah. Or Eve's right on it. Why is it in my pocket? Whoa, 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 what? Whoa. You just got what? a flashback. Yeah. Yeah. It was important, man. Yeah, all the bullshit that happened. Yeah, that girl we killed. The one we burned. Yeah. Uh. Aw, happy times. Wouldn't do to return to Desiz. Gotta get it dry cleaned. Yeah, it's made of real lace. Yeah. Because we will see each other again. Aww. Friends! And I will say, this is the only ending of the game that gives you credits. Oh, wow. So the rest just, like, end? Yeah, just ends and goes back to the title screen. So we got the good ending! Yeah. 
Sweet! So there we go. BGM and SE. Yasu Pochi Guitar Diary. The presence, the presence of music. Most of these places are really hard to search if you don't know Japanese. Mm. Uh, yeah. I think Dova Syndrome. I tried to check that out, and then Tire Side is in Japanese. Still, that was really good music direction. Yeah. There, I guess picking the music. The whole yeah. thing was pretty good. Like, I'm like constantly impressed by some of the stuff that people can manage to pull together in RPG Maker. Yeah, like they made this whole like weird survival horror game. Yeah, without even utilizing a combat system or anything. Yeah. So was this game? Do you know if it was popular in Japan before it came over here, or it had a it, it had it, I mean, like I said before, like it's called Eve because and because it was called Ibu, and people were talking about it on Twitter, or, or people or people were talking about it, and every and everybody who talked about it using romanizations called it Eve Ib, and so um, that's why and so that's why the. Uh, why the game is called Eve in this release. It's been released in multiple languages. Yay! Get a new coat. <laughs> and I like the parts of, of it are just I like the parts of it are just kind of floating. Yeah. Maybe he's a ghost too. But yeah, that so that was the end secret. that was the main ending of Eve. Awesome. Thanks for sticking with us, everybody. Thanks for sticking with us, Internet. Did you like it? I did. We'll see you. I thought it was time. actually pretty great. Yeah. Until then. Good night.